Roll this back window down for me. The reason I stopped you is this window tin is nowhere near legal. I'm sorry, officer. This is my car. I'm borrowing it. Okay. You got your license with you? Give me one second. We'll be back with you, okay? Here at 241 Tango 72. You think he's drunk? Hi. I know Tango 72, are you available to come to my location? Hey, I'm gonna go up there and make sure they're not just trying to get rid of them. Now. Okay. What's going on? What we got? I was told they were drinking and doing cocaine in the bathroom. Oh, really? Yeah, this is the driver. Um, we're both gang members, so I'm gonna pat them down. Okay. And then uh, the car smells like weed, too. Okay. All right, we'll just stop. The window tent. Okay. It's a fifteen percent legal MS thirty-two. Yeah. What the bouncer. Gotcha. Okay. Two fifteen. Yep. Okay. Come here for a second. Yeah. You got any weapons on you? Guns, knives. Grenades, anything like that? Uh, I'm just going to patch you down for safety real quick. What's that? It's cash. Oh, look. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Come on. Step out for us. Step out. You got any weapons, guns, knives, grenades, anything like that? I got right? my phone, I got my wallet. That it? What's that? Is that a charger? Lighter? Yeah, it goes with that. I'm just making sure you don't have any guns, knives, grenades, anything like that on you. Step over here. Step over. If somebody pull out a gun, they, they better shoot. That's it. You have a seat right there. The car smells like weed. You guys got any weed in the car? Um, he honestly. said it's his brother's car. I don't know. I, I've been through, I've been through this too. Last time, like back in 2016, like, I had a Honda Four. I got stopped at the shell, and um, they searched through the whole car. And like I told him, I, I was in jail in Pickens County. I I left my car. My uncle, some somebody, my cousin, and um, somebody was I guess trashing and smoking weed in there. And I was shooting with my girlfriend and girl by the uh, Bellinis. And we're coming down here. To, I'm, I was going to go actually look at some cans of cooks. I love rice. I love chicken. I love chicken. Love chicken meats. Well, that doesn't answer my question today. No, is no, it, like I said. Is there I'm weed in the car I'm there? To, I'm trying to explain what's going on is right now. Is there any I'm, cocaine in the car? No, I don't know about that. I mean, you're high. I can tell you that. Nah, I'm just, uh, he might drive. <laughs> I, I mean, what, that's why we're checking him because I can tell he's high what, too. Look. What tinted windows got to do with the passenger? If I'm good, you're smoking. Listen, because you smell weed in the car. Okay. That's what it has to do with you. Okay. I mean, if this is the car, you're both getting charged with it. That's why I said, if you're honest with me, we'll charge him with it. Let me rephrase that before we get into, like, this car smells like weed. Last time I was only, like, 17, and and the police, the canine, whatever, they came to search. I mean, it smells like weed. That's probably the car. I had no knowledge of who okay. was in the car. I got you. I, I got so, so, so you. So when you have this happening before, And I get pulled right? over and it's only... So this happened to you before, They searched it. They let me go. This, this happened to you before, right? Can you just keep an eye with, on John? If this smells like weed, I should probably just... Let's get my thumb out. Sure. Let's get my thumb out. It's like, you know, like, nobody can step on it. I'm not going to lie here. Like, what I'm saying is, if it's not yours, it's probably not good to get into the vehicle. Yeah, I don't understand. I don't know nothing about no weed. Alright. Beth, Beth, you... That's what I said. We're just... We're going to check him. Make sure he's okay to drive. Black tinted windows and maybe... I don't know. I Okay. Discriminize me and my driver because my driver is my cousin. My cousin actually 
driving. Okay, listen, I'm listen, listen to me. Early birthday celebrating. Listen to me. Listen I just to got me. my GED. I'm going to Congratulations. I'm glad. I'm going to help all these juveniles out here. I hope so. So when you go to Prior Street Juvenile Court, I'm right there translating for them. You're coming from what? Oh, that's good. No, 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 listen to me. Yes. So window 10 was illegal. Okay? Yeah, it's very illegal. I spoke to him. I want to search. I spoke to him. I know. Listen to me. Listen to what I'm saying. Listen to what I'm saying. I spoke to him. He appeared high to me when I spoke to him. Okay? That's why that man is testing his sobriety. See if he's sober enough to drive. We both smelled weed coming from the car once we stopped. Okay? That's where we're at. Okay? That's it. That, that explains the probable cause. That explains how we got here. That explains everything to you, okay? I'm not going to search car until I talk to him, too. Everything, but well, let's talk about whatever, why, whatever, winning, or before you have to talk to me, whatever. Like, everything about life. Life? Yeah. How long have you been here working for Sunday school? Two years. I've been here my whole life. Have you? And just a rich city. Just trying to keep us out. Who's us? Nobody's trying, to, Nobody's trying to kick you out. Trying to make sure there's no narcotics. It's not black. It's not white. It's not Mexican. It's not yellow. It's just rich people. Sandy Springs is a rich city, man. It's a rich city. I'm from. What's Sandy your What's your tattoo say? That's just like initials, like. What mind. does it say? Just like initials, like. What is Mayan. it? I know. I'm asking. What does it say? That's a Mayan story. Cause that looks like a Copeland 25 Copeland. tattoo to me. No. That's not what it is. I tell I you mean, I'm from here. I'm from here. Bro. I mean, I, I know I know what it is. Because that's just, what it looks like to it's me. Just, it's just like if I love Atlanta Braves, I would tie up Falcons. I would tie up Braves. Okay. Me. You know, I'm from from. Because Cobra 25 is a gang tag. I'm going to tell you something. I would never in my life disrespect an officer or nothing like that. Okay. I appreciate that. Good. Okay. Come here real quick. So this is what we're talking to him about. The car smells like weed. Right. That's why you just got checked, too. We're going to check, see if there's any weed in the car. Is there any weed in the car? Go ahead, sir. There's probably a roach or something. I smoked earlier, but that's okay. like two hours If that's ago. it, that's it. That, that's, that's all good. A roach, I can work with. So is that it? Anything else? To be honest, I'm going to just say that I did smoke earlier. Right? I got you. That, the car smells like weed. That's what I'm telling you. There's probably a roach. I'm not going to lie. You know, okay. I have nothing to lose. You know. Okay. That, and you know what? If you're honest and that's all that's in there, you'll walk away tonight, all right? Go ahead, sir. Yeah. Just stand with him real quick. The car is actually pretty clean except for the cocaine. Oh, Whose is that? Not either of yours? It probably got stuck to our feet. I mean, we went to the restroom and all that, you know? All right. I'm just going to give you all ticket for it, and you all go. Okay. Yes, you can take it. You guys have been cooperative, look, so. Because, look, we've been to the restroom. I don't know if you're so dirty, but, but we've been to the restroom, right? Okay, listen to me. Yeah, hey, I told right. somebody about Y'all were, so were cooperative. Y'all were honest. I mean, it was on the floor. Right. So, guess what? You're going to get a city ordinance ticket for it, and you go home tonight, all right? Okay. Go ahead and have a seat in the car. that, though? City ordinance, just the disorderly conduct violation. So do I have to go to court for that? You you can, oh, so or you can pay it out. I could take you for the felony charge if I want. Right. I mean, I mean, I'm, I'm you glad you're that. doing your job, <laughs> sir. But um, that's really not like that. I just want to know what's the city ordinance. It means like, exactly like well, it doesn't go against it doesn't go against your record. Right. It stays off your record. You don't get a state charge. Right. You just go through the city of Sandy Springs, and that's it. So, we have a city ordinance violation for drugs. That's right. all you're getting cited for. It's like the easiest way instead of taking you for a felony possession. Okay. Which this would be a felony possession. Okay? Yeah. Okay. Right. Go ahead and have a seat in the car, guys. Thank you. Hey, you read, you read my name, right? Yeah. Please? Yeah, you don't have any warrants. No, but like, I want to be a police officer. Hey. 23. Sir, who's going to get the city ordinance? Both of you. Unless one of you wants to take it. All right. Like I said, just city ordinance violation, DC. So you've been you've been through this before. Supposedly, but you know they let me go without no. They say a warning, like I don't know something about. Okay. They even had my girl panic. Okay. Um. 
I see sign next to X, not a mention of guilt, just saying you're going to show up for or pay this out, okay? okay? It's just literally just, it doesn't go on your record or anything like that, but you can come to court and fight it if you want to. But, but I got to come and pay like that. Or you can get probation too, depending on your criminal record. Exactly, I got to see. Are you seeing? This is you, you back? Yeah, look. Doesn't even look like you. It is. I just got a long hair now. Come on, look at my nose. You gonna misplace my nose? Even the misplace the nose. Even the eyebrows. Look cute. Yeah. Maybe one day I can be a mayor. All right, man. Here's here's the deal. I talked, told him this whole thing too. You guys pulled out, I saw your window tent, because you tried to roll the window down to, so I couldn't see it. Oh, no. Nah, well, I, that's what I, I thought you were doing, so I pulled you over the window I'm tent. I'm sorry to interrupt you, but I always, I always pull my window down. Okay. Well, that's what it looked like to me. I'm sorry. All right. That's but cool. here's what, here's, I'm giving you a warning for the window tent. You're not going to take it for that, just for the the cocaine. Okay. And again, it's a city ordinance violation. doesn't go on your record or anything like that. Once I pulled you over, right. immediately, I know, immediately smelled marijuana coming from the car. I also thought you might have been high just by the way. It might have been the light too from your eyes. I know he's high. Yeah. I can tell. So that's why I brought that gentleman over here to just to make sure you're okay to drive. Yeah. Obviously, because the marijuana gives us probable cause to search your vehicle. You were honest with us. You said there might be a roach. I mean, there was some cocaine that wasn't a roach, but you were so cooperative. That's why you're just getting a ticket tonight. You're going home. Okay? I got you. And play pool, but I, I never thought I would um, pick up a back of the day. Whatever happened, happened. I, I, like I said, you were so cooperative. That's why you're getting off tonight, okay? I just need you to sign next to the X, non admission of guilt, just saying you're showing up court or pay the ticket out, okay? Again, okay, city um, ordinance violation for drugs. All right, that's it. That's it. I'll, I'll give it to you. Here is, uh, is your license back. This is the warning for the window tent. Don't have to worry about it. This is the one you got to take care of, okay? November 28th and 9.30 is a court date. All right? All right, guys. Get home safe. Take it easy.